Hello and welcome to the Sound of Science. Today we will talk about a groundbreaking study showing that the mRNA vaccine against COVID-19 is highly effective in the Israeli vaccinated population. So far we knew that the mRNA vaccines developed by Pfizer and Moderna were highly effective in clinical trials before the vaccine was distributed throughout the world to the extent of a 94 to 95 percent. However, we weren't sure whether this high efficacy would also stand in a field vaccination outside the setting of a clinical trial. In this study published by a group of Israeli and British scientists and physicians led by Professor Ron Balitzer, that was published in the New England Journal of Medicine, the investigators assessed the efficacy of this vaccine in a cohort of Israel's largest medical services provider, Klalit, and this study included individuals that were vaccinated between December 20th and January 1st, it's a period of 43 days, during which one and a half million individuals were vaccinated, out of which Almost 600,000 were eligible to participate in the study, and they were matched with 600,000 unvaccinated individuals that had the same demography and medical parameters. The investigators assessed how many individuals were positives for COVID-19, how many showed symptoms, hospitalizations, severe disease, and death. The efficacy of the vaccine was tested on three distinct time points, three weeks following the first vaccine, between the third and the fourth week following the first vaccine, and a week after the second vaccine. What you can see here is that there is an increased efficacy in prevention of the infection as early as three weeks following the first vaccinations, and over 90% efficacy following the second vaccine. A similar effect can be observed when looking at symptoms. 57% efficacy following the first vaccine, which rises up to 94% a week after the second vaccine. Looking at prevention of hospitalizations, the percentages are impressive. 74% efficacy following the first vaccine and 87% a week after the second vaccine. Looking at the prevention of severe disease, 62% efficacy following only the first vaccine, which rises to 92% after the second vaccine. Death rates, 72% efficacy three weeks following the first vaccine, which rises to 84% on the third and fourth weeks following the first vaccine. The study had not enough data regarding uh, prevention of death following the second vaccine. So, so far the study shows that even three weeks following the first vaccine, there is a very effective prevention of infection, symptoms, hospitalizations, severe disease and death. However, what about the older population? We know that specifically in COVID-19, the older population is the most susceptible uh, with respect to death rates. And indeed, we can see that three weeks following the first vaccine, individuals younger than the age of 70 show a higher efficacy uh, of the vaccine compared to individuals that are 70 years and older. Looking at three to four weeks following the first vaccine, we can see that there is a still effect of age on the efficacy of the vaccine with younger individuals being more protected. A week after the second vaccine, we can see that the efficacy of the vaccine is comparable between all age groups, including and importantly, the elderly population, which is great news. The study showed us that the vaccine is effective as early as three weeks following the first vaccine and the efficacy rises as time passes, as well as after the second vaccine. But we also saw that the vaccine is very effective also in the elderly population, which is most critical specifically for this disease. That would be all for now. Stay safe.